Today in the studio I'm attaching the skirt section of my dress Dina to the bodice. There's a layer of tulle and there's also a layer of satin and then I attach it to the bodice here. But what I'm going to do first, I've got my pattern pieces out for my bodice, I'm just going to run a layer of stay tape just around the bottom just so it doesn't um, stretch the bottom of the bodice. Now that's done, I can start pinning the first layer it is the tool, which is this. So I'm going to pin that on first, sew it, and then I can put the other layer on. So I put right sides together. Now what I need to do is actually put this ruching so it's even along each section, because what you don't want is suddenly like one clump of ruching in one bit and then none in the other. I've roughly pinned on all my different sections. What I'm doing when I'm sewing is I'm pulling the ruching down and making sure that this, all of the ruche stitching is to the other side so I don't get that under, uh, below the stitch. So I've just finished sewing, so that's the first layer. So I've, man I've got all the tools sewn on there and I'm just holding it up. It looks pretty even to me, thank goodness. So now what I'm going to do is sew the next layer on, which is my satin. So I'm just pressing it, not steaming it. Now it's ready for the next layer. So I'm going to do the same as I did with the tool. Line up the side seams first, get them secure, and the centre front and pin and sew. I've just finished sewing the silk to the skirt as well. Yay! It's starting to look like a wedding dress. So exciting. Um, now I'm going to give it a press. I've finished sewing and popped it on the stand and then put it into the lining but you can see it's really taking shape and it looks gorgeous and then once I've done all that it's going to look like when I put the overlay over the top because what I'm going to do with this just to make this seam less harsh I'm actually hand tacking this on you get this nice sort of crossover of seam and it just softens this harsh line here because I don't want to put like beading on or anything. I'm not a big fan of things like that. Now Dina is ready to be sewn into her lining. <laughs>